She think she think I'm a reporter by mom to don't look at me the whole time. Stop. <laughs> I thoroughly hate you. <laughs> okay. So now let's pick our tree out. Okay, Tay. You get them nerves. Oh, balls. <laughs> These blue ones, though, they are pretty. Yeah. On a white tree? On a white snowy tree? Mm hmm. You want to do blue this year? Bro. Hmm? This is your Christmas. Okay, let's get blue. Okay, guys. Like, the hardest thing ever is going to the store with Tay because I am very frugal. But he don't care. He want to be like, oh, I want the nice one, blah, 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 blah. So, cool. So, we decided on the tree. Wonderful. And then the um, topper. I hope he didn't just put his hand up at me. We can just have one side falcons. Let's do one side red and black, the other side blue and silver. Okay, that's not gonna be cute, but we'll figure it out. Let's get it and go. Are you rushing me, woman? I'm, yeah, because I want to get something to eat too. Oh, There's nothing to DoorDash on Sundays for me. The Lord's meal is closed. All right, come on, sir. Like it? I Love it? You know, it's only fitting that we put these up today as we win and beat her hometown, the Baltimore Ravens. I don't care about football. Oh. <laughs> In that case, justify. And this is why I use my own bathroom. So, out here. I love when you spend time in my bathroom. I'm just joking. I hate wearing my bathroom. Hey guys, so here's a tip. Here's a life lesson. You should have separate bathrooms. Oh, brush your teeth. Yo, so Michelle Obama was doing an interview and they asked her. How did you make your, your marriage last so long? And she responded by having separate bathrooms. And of course, whoever was interviewing her laughed, but... That's true. Bruh. It's so true. Bruh. Having separate bathrooms. I wish we could show you what her bathroom looks like. <laughs> and then show you what mine looks like. I do have a, I think I have a clip of your bathroom. When I tell you. Ooh, we got people on watching already. Look, look, right hey, there. Hey, it's not live. Oh. <laughs> but, uh. Are you even in the camera? Are you just talking to the side? Yeah, I'm too tall. What about? I'm 6'9. Okay. Nah, uh. But how tall does it make me? Huh? If you're 6'9, how tall am I? But look at the camera, bro. You like 4'7. How are you 6'9 and I'm 4'? Okay, Tay. <laughs> Y'all, I don't entertain Tay. I keep forgetting. Sometimes I forget not to entertain Tay and his foolishness because Tay is really like too much for me. But anyway. But, Separate bathrooms. Can you come into the camera? No. So, separate bathrooms. Tay! <laughs> separate bathrooms. Um, it seems funny, but like separate bathrooms is like a real thing. You know, because your bathroom, like, there's not a lot of places that you can get privacy, but the bathroom is definitely one of them. And I don't give Tay much privacy in the bathroom either, to be 100% honest. But, <laughs> but like, 
the bathroom is where you can have privacy your personality like i'm not a very organized person so i have stuff all over the place and that's okay you know but like the bathroom kind of gives you that freedom to do whatever you want to do however you want to do it so his bathroom like he decorated it like the colors in there like that was all him and then my bathroom it's my bathroom <laughs> <laughs> It is it's my bathroom. So yeah, but besides that, besides like, that, we talk a lot about. We talk, a, we talk a lot about <laughs> what makes like a good marriage, and we've only been married for one year, but I feel like we have some things like pretty down pat. And so like one of my biggest things, I know people say communication, that's like a really cliche one, but like it's true. Communication is definitely something that will help a relationship, <laughs> will help any kind of relationship, whether it's a marriage or a relationship, but not only- Unless you talk too much. Anyway, I do talk a lot, I don't care. But besides communication, I think acceptance is even more important. Like being able to accept somebody for who they are. Like Tay, Tay dresses up every day of the week. Tay only owns one pair of jeans, but he wears dress clothes all the time. But he doesn't judge me for wearing t-shirt, and, and um, sweatpants, just like I don't judge him for wearing, well, he does judge, but I mean, the whole point is that, <laughs> stop trying to ruin my point. Okay, Tay, let's turn this off so we can have a conversation. Another, <laughs> so thing, is, another thing is that we handle our issues in private. We don't tell everybody our business. So I'm smiling right now, but when I turn this camera off. <laughs> I'm going to be at work. That's true. That's true. Because he's always working. Tay works seven days a week. So another tip? Yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't work seven days a week. You work seven days a week, lock. You work seven days a week. When you off, you on. Hmm. <laughs> okay, so what's your tip? Um, what you said, communication and acceptance. Yeah. Different bathrooms. Yeah. Uh, um. I don't think you in the frame. I am in the frame. It ain't my fault that the frame is not tall. You said acceptance and communication. Mm -hmm. Bruh, this for all the men out there. What works in a relationship or a marriage is making bets. I made a bet that she could not shut up for two days. That I wouldn't talk to you for two days. Two days. She could not talk to me or talk around me. I could not hear her voice for two days. And I paid her an amount of money. You paid off a credit card for me. Oh, that's what that one was? Yeah. <laughs> Um, so yeah, make some bets to keep them out of your way. That's not nice. Oh, it works though. It's not just to keep you out of the way though. It's, it's really, it just makes fun. Like, yeah, it's fun. Up your yeah. life and stuff like that. Yeah, we so, make all kind of bets. Yeah, and another tip that we can give that has worked for us is that we like to write not just bets, but like we'll write a whole contract. And it's not oh, even yeah. a whole contract. We'll just get like a paper, like a napkin or something, and like just write out, you know, a rule or something that we're trying to like live by or abide by or whatever. And it's not to like restrict the other person, but it's really just to have like to set clear communication boundaries between the two of us, which is also really nice. Um, I think that's really all the tips that I can think of right now. I'm gonna do a lot of B roll and all kind of stuff. I love Ted. Ted, my best friend. He's so cute and handsome. Oh God. Can I see that? Can I see this? I'm not gonna edit that out. Ted's rubbing my butt. Ooh. <laughs> Tay and K sitting in the tree. <laughs> All right. Bye. Oh, you have something to say? No. Oh. <laughs> Tip of the day. Bye. Boop. That's what they do in the videos. Oh. Hit it. Five. No, you have to cover it. Like, when you do it, <laughs> the screen goes like blank.